I'm climbing in. Jesus! With the state-of-the-art generators fired up, James fortified himself for the journey and then simply drove off the launch pad. Oh, my God. Whoa! Oh, shit, it's really high. It's really high, you bloke. I'm turning the engine off. We had to test. Well, exactly. Well, you had to go first, don't, obviously. Don't look at us and think we're bad, because that was sense. That was scientifically vigorous. It's a cable car. It's a cable car. I've been on lots of cable cars. Cable cars are very safe. Oh, God, look, he's going. That's, this is where it's high. That's horrible. I oh, know, it's going really high. I don't like... Ah! <laughs> I hate you! OK. okay. He, he doesn't like us. Despite my terror, the cable buggy kept on chugging through what's technically Angolan airspace towards the beach. God, I'm nearly there. Neutral, handbrake off. He's going to do it. He's going to do it. I'm at the end. He's down. That's a landing. Yes! Do you know what, though? What? I'm doing maths here. Mm -hmm. One of us is going to be killed doing this, obviously. Yes? I'd say so, yeah. So, when we were all here, 33% chance. Now I'm doing it with a 50% chance. What do you mean, now you're doing it? Well, I'm I, going next. Well, I can go next. Why you, you can't go why next. Why are you going next? Why can't I? Whilst James toasted his success with some more drink, I won the argument and prepared for launch. My rectum has just opened like a set of theatre curtains. And for good reason, because my beach buggy weighed 200 kilograms more than James's charred wreck. Ooh. Oh, he brushed the grass. I'm terrified, I'll be honest, but for the first time since I set off, I'm comfortable in my beach buggy. Approaching the beach, approaching the end of the journey. Here I come. And touchdown. Yes! Bad news, Hammond. I've made it. Oh, great. Sir? Oh, I say, James. Actually, I was lucky there was some left because James had had a bit of a thirst on whilst he'd been alone. Oh. Hello, guys, down there. It's Richard at the top. Right, I'm going to do this now, so goodbye. Oh, I don't like that feeling. Uh, oh. Here he comes, ladies and gentlemen, Richard Hammond. I could take solace from the fact that this system has already run twice with their cars and not failed. It's been tested. Or I could take a more realistic view, which is that those two fat oaks have already weakened it. Plus, he had all that scrap metal in the back, which is why all eyes were on him. Well, when I say all... Look at the colours in those rocks over there. It's, it's fantastic. Just to the left of where Hammond is. Why is my car sitting so low? It is heavy. It is. Why is it lower? The colouring in yeah, there is are. fabulous, isn't it? This is it! I can see the beach, I'm so nearly there, we are going to do it! Come on, Hammond, come on. I'm going to do it. Come on, Hammond, come on. Oh. Hammond! Come on! I've stopped! Hammond! It's just stopped! What can I do? It's just stopped! Is there nothing you can do? Sadly, James was too drunk to think, and I'm mechanically inept. Plus, whatever had gone wrong had gone wrong at the top, and we were at the bottom. Move! 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 
There's literally nothing we can do. We've assessed everything and you're in a hopeless position. Let's have another beer. <laughs>